Doctor, I want to lose weight. What should I do? Do you want my camera? What about my iPhone 12 Pro Max? What about my Lamborghini? What about a hundred million dollars? Congrats, you're skinny now. Do you all understand how to use longitude, latitude, and degrees now? Yeah. So what if I asked you to meet me for lunch at 55 degrees, 6 minutes north latitude, and 72 degrees, 8 minutes east longitude? You'd be eating by yourself. <gasps> Better run back over to my house before 12 a.m. I'll see you next year. <laughs> Good one. Hey, Luke. What? Why was six afraid of nine on New Year's Eve? I don't know. Why? Because nine, eight, seven, six, five, four, oh. three, two, two one. one. Happy New Year! Luke, guess what? What? I haven't showered since last year. <laughs> the haircut's $25. I don't know what's worse, your IQ or your hairline. You know what's funny? What? Not you, so shut up. Can <gasps> I get some medications for hiccups, please? Ow! What did you do that for? Well, you don't have hiccups anymore, do you? I never had hiccups. My wife does. <gasps> We're gonna do a memory test. What's three times three? 274. It's your turn. What's three times three? Tuesday. Okay, your turn. What's three times three? Nine? Yes, that's it. How did you get the answer? Simple. I subtracted 274 from Tuesday. <coughs> Dad, do you believe in ghosts? Of course not. Ghosts don't exist. But the maid said there's ghosts here. Son, pack your bags. Uh, why? We don't have a maid. Where's my birthday gift? Can you see the red hot Ferrari on the other side of the road? Yes, yes, yes! Oh my gosh, I love you! I bought the same color nail polish for you. Look what I brought home! <gasps> Is that for us? No! It's for the neighbors! Is this your homework? No! It's my job application! Is that a ten dollar bill? No! It's a million dollars! Doctor, wherever I touch, it hurts. What exactly do you mean? When I touch my shoulder, it hurts. When I touch my knee, ouch! And when I touch my forehead, it really, really hurts. I know it's wrong. Your finger is broken. My family's always wanted a ping pong table, but they could be really expensive, and we don't want to spend that kind of money. So that's where this thing comes in handy. This portable net is way more affordable and convenient. You can literally bring it with you and play it wherever you want. If you want to get one for yourself, you can get it from the link on my profile. Now watch this. <laughs> Why are you late? There was a man who lost a $100 bill. That's nice, were you helping him look for it? No, I was standing on it. What?! Ah, this stupid computer is broken. Luke, can you help me? What's the problem? It says press F5, but it doesn't work. Okay, show me. Press F5. My laugh will arrive in four to five business days. <laughs> Edit. The package got stolen. <laughs> See, those oh. ones make me laugh. This dude speaks as if he's figuring out English each time he opens his mouth <laughs> and is surprised by the sounds slash words that are coming out. It's true. But then, just wait. A couple comments down on the exact same video. I don't know why y'all hate... I don't know why y'all love... I don't know why y'all... <clears throat> I can't even read this now because of the last <laughs> comment. <laughs> All you do is sit on the Xbox. No, I don't. Then what do you do? I sit on the chair. Photos you're not supposed to see. Here's what the Teletubbies look like without their heads. Here's where the picture on the cliff bar was taken. Here's what a magic eight ball really looks like. Here's what a ramen noodle cup looks like on the inside. And here's how pineapples are grown. All parents think guests will act when you don't clean your room. I ain't gonna cry too long. No. I'm back on my drip, yeah. Drip my drip my drip, drip. Right back on my drip, yeah. I ain't gonna cry too long. Nah. I'm back on my drip. Whoa. Drip my drip my drip, yeah. Right back yeah. on my yeah. drip, yeah. Can't try. Real life glitches caught on camera. A guy pulled out a camera to take a picture of a bird when he seen this helicopter taking off. The helicopter starts flying, but the propellers aren't even moving. A dad was recording his son while he was looking in the mirror. The boy turned around to look at the camera, but his reflection in the mirror didn't follow his actions. In 1995, when Mike Tyson was boxing, there was somebody in the crowd recording on a phone. But the thing is, phones with cameras didn't come out until five years after this fight. And finally, these people were having a street race on the highway. As soon as the cars passed, you could see a dog 
in the middle of the highway. It would have been impossible to miss it, so it had to have teleported. I'm sorry what happened between us a month ago. Are you still mad at me? Twinkle, twinkle, little star. How I wonder what you are? Wish I could hit you with my car. <gasps> hey. What? How are you? Do I know you? I'm rich. Hi, I'm you Tina. I'm 18 years old. Nice to meet you. No, no. Rich is my name. Sorry, I don't talk to boys. Okay, I'll call 911. I'm calling, but it just keeps coming up busy. Can you tell me what's going on? That's not Herb. Um, uh, Mom, it's Herb. He's sitting in the living room now. When are you coming home? You let him in? You have to do everything I say, okay? Okay. What's he doing right now? Now I want you guys to comment if I should tell her or send a picture. Based on your comments, I'll pick one and post part three tomorrow. But if you want to find out what happens right now and read a bunch more stories, just click the link on my profile and download the app. Dinner's ready. Okay, I'll be there in like 30 seconds. No, you're gonna turn it off and come eat right now. Five? Okay, okay. Mom, is dinner almost ready? Oh, shoot. We just finished eating. Sorry, I forgot to come and tell you that it was ready. Dinner's ready. Okay, I just need to finish this game, then I'll come. Of course, honey. You can come whenever you're ready. You know what? I'll bring you your food so you can continue playing. What happened? Why are you so sad? My girlfriend broke up with me. How come? It's all because of you. What? How? You told me to get her a chain for her birthday. Did you give her one with fake gold? No, I gave her a bicycle chain. <gasps> Here's the three most dangerous kid toys. In the 1990s, Rollerblade Barbie was released. Each Rollerblade used the same wheel mechanism they use in cigarette lighters. So when the Barbie was rolled, they would shoot out sparks. In 1996, the Cabbage Patch Snack Time Kid was released. It ate plastic foods that came with it and exited through a hole in the backpack. But the toy couldn't tell whether it was plastic, your finger, or your hair. And one girl's hair was ripped down to her scalp. Finally, in the 1990s, Nickelodeon released Moon Shoes, which you would strap onto your feet and the springs would help you jump higher. However, they weren't very safe and lots of people sprained and broke their ankles. All right. Okay, you actually have 11 fingers, so... 11 fingers. Okay, wait, let me count. Why would I say count? I have five, five. One, two, three, four, five, six, seven, eight, nine, ten. <laughs> I don't know why I counted. One, one two, two... Skip these three. Three. Four, ah, five. Come on, man. She just went from one, two, skip these, three, four, five, like... Six, seven, You're obviously gonna eight, get 11 now. Nine... 10, 10 11. 11. Oh, mind blow! Luke, what is the past participle of the verb to ring? What do you think it is, ma'am? I don't think. I know. I don't think I know either. <gasps> hey, can you do the dishes, please? All of them? Yes, all the dishes. But all I did is put one cup in. Don't make me ask you again! Okay, okay, fine. Hey! Who are you? I'm your son. Get out of my house before I call the cops! Let me take that from you, honey. Is there anything else I can do? Can you make me a peanut butter and jelly sandwich? Coming right up! Mythical creatures people have seen in real life. For a long time, the giant squid was considered a mythical creature that whipped the boats of sailors. But thanks to the advance in science, in 2004, a giant squid was found in its natural habitat. In 1967, two explorers filmed the creature walking in a Californian forest, which to this day is suspected to be Bigfoot. The chupacabra is a mythical creature that supposedly sucks the blood out of cattle, but there's a farmer who claimed he killed it. Mermaids are described as enchanting creatures. It is said that through their singing, they attract sailors. Many claim to have taken pictures with them, all the way from Mexico and Jamaica to the coast of some African countries. Can I have money for a gym membership? Will you become John Cena by going to the gym? Am I becoming Einstein by going to school? secrets and everyday items that you didn't know about. Have you ever wondered why doorknobs are made out of brass or some sort of alloy metal? This is because those materials help prevent bacteria from spreading. If you take the lid off your cup and place it underneath, it fits perfectly as a coaster. Have you ever wondered why there's a hole in plane windows? The hole is in the middle pane of the three window panes. It takes off pressure from the outer pane so the window doesn't break. Gas pump hoses are attached by magnets, so if you forget to take out the hose, the pump won't go with you. The number on the side of lotion tells you how long the product will last so you don't damage your skin. The different colors on the bottom of toothpaste tubes actually mean something. Blue means it's made with natural resources and medicine. Green means it's only made with natural resources. Red means it's made with natural resources and some chemical compositions. And black means it's made with pure chemicals. Why did you hit my son? Because he called me fat. By slapping him, you think you'll lose weight? <laughs> Look at this picture of my horses. Why did you cut off one's tail? I couldn't tell them apart. 
Stupid, can't you see the brown one's a bit taller than the black one? Quick, keep scrolling if you get addicted easily. This game is number one on the racing category and I can't stop playing it. You try and get to the finish line before anybody else and you could pick up boards to get across the water as a shortcut. If you want to try it for yourself, click the link on my profile, then press shortcut game to download it for free. Here's the only way to survive a grenade blast. The first thing you want to do is turn the other direction and get at least 15 feet away. Then lay on your stomach with the bottom of your feet pointing at the grenade. This will reduce your chances of getting hit by the fragments. But if you do get hit, it will be the bottom of your shoes instead of your skin. Now before I tell you what to do if there's a grenade in the water with you, I found this app that tells you your celebrity lookalike, and apparently I look like Marilyn Monroe. If you want to find out who you look like, just press this button on my profile. Now if there's a grenade in the water with you, don't swim deeper, get out. Swimming deeper will cause the blast of the grenade to compress your lungs and cause serious damage. Here is the only way to survive a plane crash. When booking your flight, try to get a seat in the exit row or within 5 seats from it. People in those seats have the highest survival rates. Wear pants and a long sleeve shirt made of non-inflammable material like cotton or denim. And sturdy shoes. You want clothes that don't restrict movement but also protect you against flames and flying debris. Bring a smoke hood or a wet cloth in a plastic bag. Most people survive impact but die of smoke inhalation. If you don't have these, breathe through your clothes. When boarding the plane, count the seats between you and the nearest front and rear emergency exit. So if it gets smoky, you could feel your way to safety. When instructed, brace yourself by putting your feet on the ground, crossing your arms on the seat in front of you, and lowering your head. Remain that way until you come to a complete stop, then by crouching so you still get some air, leave the plane and get away as far as possible. Gross habits that are actually good for you. Burping after you eat a meal is actually good for your stomach because it helps relieve it of air. When you bite your nails, you consume some of the bacteria that's on them. This makes your immune system start producing white blood cells which helps fight bacteria. Studies showed that kids who suck on their thumbs or bite their nails are less likely to suffer from allergies. Taking showers washes away your essential oils which are necessary to protect and hydrate your skin. So it's healthy if you skip showers every once in a while. Hey Nathan, can you fix my computer? So what was wrong? It was an ID10T error. An ID10T error? What is that in case I have to fix it again? Haven't you heard of an ID10T error before? No. Write it down and I think you'll figure it out. What's the salary for the job? For now, 500, but later it could go up to 1,000. Okay then, I'll come back later. I can't figure out the answer to this question. Which one? Number seven. What's the hardest natural substance on Earth? Oh, so out of all the natural substances on Earth, which one's the hardest? I don't know what a natural substance is, though. Uh, do you play Minecraft? Yeah. What's the hardest natural substance in the game? Uh, diamonds? Maybe. I don't know. You're going to pay a big fine for all those fish in your bucket. But officer, these are my pet fish. I bring them here to swim, and then they hop back in the bucket. Oh really? This I've got to see. If you can prove it, I'll let you go. Okay, let me put them in the water. So, where are the fish? What fish? Today I received LED light strips from Govi, and as you could tell, I love adding lights to my room, but since I have so many, I decided I wanted to surprise my parents by putting them in the kitchen and getting their reaction at the end of the video. But in order to hide the wires, I had to drill through the cupboard, so I had to get my dad's approval so I didn't get in trouble, but my mom still has no clue. You can control the lights using the remote or through the mobile app. These lights are perfect for the big game this weekend because you can set the color of lights as the colors of your favorite team. And there's also DIY modes like this one called chasing. Now that they're all set up, it's time to get my mom's reaction. Alright, you can come out now. When you're at work, do you like it? Yeah, it looks pretty good. Do you know which mouse can walk on two legs? No. Mickey Mouse, and which duck can walk on two legs? Donald Duck? No, every duck can walk on two legs. Dumbest lottery winners. After winning 1.3 million dollars in the California lottery, Dennis Rossi filed for divorce from Thomas Rossi so she wouldn't have to share the money with him. Thomas decided to sue her for violating state law and he kept all the money. Michael Carroll won 14 million dollars when he was just 19. After claiming he wouldn't spend the money on dumb things, he bought multiple luxury cars, mansions, and other expensive things. To this day, he lost all his money and works at a cookie factory. Jack Whitaker won 315 million dollars in the US lottery. When he claimed it, he took it all in cash. However, thieves broke into his house and took millions of dollars.
Doctor, my wife can barely hear me. I would try standing far away from her and ask her a question, then slowly move forward and see how far you are away when she responds. Okay, I'll try that. Honey, what's for supper? Honey, what's for supper? Honey, what's for supper? Honey, what's for supper? For the fourth time, it's lasagna! Why did everyone get a bad mark? Because there's a hard test. That test was easy! Yeah, because you have the answers. Hello? Hi, I have a pepperoni bacon pizza with red peppers and pineapples. Um, I didn't order a pizza. This must be a mistake. No, it's not. Your neighbor forgot their Instagram password and wanted to share with you what they're having for supper. <gasps> hey mom, can I go to a movie tonight with my friends? Um, how are you getting there? I was hoping you could drive me. <laughs> I'm not leaving this bed, so unless you figure out another way to get there, you're not going. Hey mom? Mom? Yes, you're my mom. Oh, you're one of Luke's friends. How did you even get in our house? Anyway, he's just in his bedroom over there. Hey, Mom, can I go to Jesse's house tonight for an hour? Of course you can. What time are you wanting to go? Because I have a meeting at 6. Oh, that's what time I wanted to go. You know what? It doesn't matter. I'll cancel it. Babe, you have so many gaps between your teeth. So what? It looks like your tongue's in jail. Guess what? The funniest thing happened today. And what were you going to say? I got a concussion. Did you actually? How? A flower pot fell from your apartment building this morning when I was coming to visit you and hit me on the head. What were you gonna tell me? Oh, well I was gonna tell you my mom's flower pot fell and hit someone on the head this morning. <laughs> I'm gonna show you how you can keep using TikTok even if it gets banned. TikTok is getting banned from the App Store this Sunday, but as long as you have it downloaded, you'll still be able to use it. However, they have until November 12th to make a deal before it's permanently banned. So if you want to be on the safe side, click the link on my profile, then press TikTok hack and download the app. Once you open the app, you're going to want to change your location to somewhere that still has it, like Canada. Since it's only getting banned in America, TikTok will figure from Canada and you'll still be able to use it. Hey, do you want to go to the movie theater with me? To watch a movie? No, to count how many seats there are. Oh hey, are you shopping for groceries too? No, I'm hunting unicorns. Ooh, did you hurt yourself? No, do you want me to do it again? Secrets movie theaters don't want you to know. Movie theaters earn very little from ticket sales. That's why they decided to lower the cost of tickets and raise the cost of food. So the earnings would go entirely to the movie theater. Food combos won't always save you money. Sometimes it's just a strategy to make you think it's the best option. So next time check if it's better to buy a combo or buy the food separately. Sometimes there's people yelling at the cabin for the movie to start. But what they don't know is that the cabin is completely empty. Thanks to new technology, human assistance isn't needed. Movies will never start at the time the ticket says it will. This way they'll get more people to watch the ads before the movie. Movie. And if you ever thought you were cool sneaking into another movie than the one that you bought, the employees don't really care as long as there are seats available. Did you know Apple's designing a car? Really? When will it launch? I don't know. They're having trouble installing the windows. Yo, bro, Jimmy just got married too. So what? Bro, all of our friends are married and have jobs and we're stuck here in the bar. We need to do something. I have an idea. What is it? Let's unfollow them. <gasps> this is such a good song. This song is so old. Same with your parents. But you still listen to them. Did you eat all your food? No! I pressed the delete button on my keyboard. Ah, oh, shoot. Did you just spill water on the floor? No! The floor was thirsty! Create password... And... Enter. Are you human? No! I'm a guinea pig! <laughs> it's time to get up and get ready for school! <sighs> Mom... I don't think I can go to school today. <laughs> just suck it up and go get ready. You're gonna make me late for work. But I really don't feel good. <laughs> I'm not buying it. I'll be waiting in the car. Mom? What? I'm not feeling very good. And what do you want me to do about it? Can I stay home today? I don't care. You can walk to school, take the bus, stay in bed, whatever. Just leave me alone. <sighs> My little angel! Is everything alright? Yeah? Uh, you don't look very well. Do you want me to get you some soup? Mom, I'm fine. You know what? I'll call the school right now and let them know you won't be in for the rest of the year, okay?
It's freezing out here, isn't it? I know, and I forgot my toucan mitts. Oh man, what were you thinking? Oh, it's safe and sound. What's the problem, officer? You were going at least 75 in a 50 zone. No, sir, I was going 65. Harry, you were going 80. I'm also going to give you a ticket for your broken taillight. A broken taillight? I didn't know about that. Harry, you've known about that taillight for weeks. Mm -hmm. I'm also going to give you a citation for not wearing your seatbelt. Oh, I just took it off when you were walking up to the car. Harry, you never wear your seatbelt. Shut your mouth! Ma'am, does your husband always talk to you this way? No, only when he's drunk. I love you. I don't love you. Think again. No, no, and no. Waiter, bring separate bills. Oh, okay, okay, I love you. They're talking so loud I can't even hear the teacher. Excuse me, I can't hear. This is a private conversation you're not supposed to hear. What's going on, boys and girls? It's your boy, Luke Davidson. Luke! Oh, are you making a video? No! I'm talking to the wall. Hey, Luke, are you talking to me? No! I'm talking to the ghost. Did you just slap me? No! I gave your face a high five. This is going to be your homework for tonight. This is our homework? No! It's food for your dog. Are you gonna buy that? No! I'm just giving it a ride. <sighs> hey, do you need any help? No! I'm just waving my hands in the air for no reason. Okay, have a nice day. Your life must suck. It does, and you wanna know why? Why? Because you're in it! Alright, so this is gonna be your workspace right here, and... We're is that the fire alarm? Yes, it is. We better get out of here. Oh, and you know the drill, right? Yeah. Hi, it's nice to see you again. Yeah, same to you. I use Pantene. What shampoo do you use? Marks. I use Dove Soap. What about you? Marks. I use Olay Lotion. What about you? Marks. Is Mark an international brand? No. Mark is my roommate. Do you ever wanted to compete for 1 million unicorns? Well now you can because Wipeout is coming to your city. But if I were you, I would start training because you only have 3 months to prepare. Challenge accepted! After training hard for 2.5 months, something devastating happened. <coughs> After hearing from the doctors that he broke his ankle, he lost all hopes in being able to compete. Two weeks later, he sat down on the couch to watch the event live on TV, but then the unexpected happened. Due to the bad snowstorms and dangerous driving conditions, the event organizers have decided to move it to a similar online game called Fall Guys because everyone can now play it for free on all platforms. Little did everyone know he had been practicing for the past two weeks. After passing all the courses with ease, he was on to the finals. Only two players remain. Who's gonna win? Oh, 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 and we have a winner! And that is the story about Unicorn Kyle. Make sure to go check out Fall Guys and play it for free. If you could kiss me for free or the hottest girl in the world for a thousand dollars, who would you pick? No question, of course I'd pick you. What? Then who's the hottest girl in the world? <gasps> no parents think you will act when they tell you to get some fresh air. I ain't gonna cry too long. I'm back on my drip. Drip my drip my drip. Right back on my drip. Yeah. I ain't gonna cry too long. I'm back on my drip. Drip my drip my drip. Yeah. Right back yeah, on my drip. Yeah. How your parents think you will act when they tell you to smarten up? I ain't gonna cry too long. No. I'm back on my drip. Yeah. Drip my drip my drip. drip. Right back on my drip. drip. Yeah. I ain't gonna cry too long. Nah. I'm back on my drip. Whoa. Drip my drip my drip. Yeah. Right back yeah. on. I want to break up with you. What? Why? Because I want someone who's strong, tall, and handsome, which isn't you. You're short, skinny, and nerdy. Excuse me, sorry to bother you. I just think you're really handsome. Can I get your phone number? No thanks. What? Why not? Don't you remember? I missed your short, skinny, and nerdy. Yeah, yeah. Track and dope. Turn me to a superhero, yeah. Here is the only way to survive a shark attack. <laughs>
Try to avoid fishing boats. When a fish gets hooked, it bleeds and attracts sharks. Also avoid swimming at night because the sharks won't be able to see as well and they might mistake you as fish. The odds of being attacked by a shark are 11.5 million to 1, but if you're still scared, here's how you could defend yourself. Sharks are sensitive in their gills, so you're going to want to keep punching them until you can slowly back away. An Australian and an American surfer both did this and they survived. Luke, where's your homework? I'm really sorry, I don't have it here. How come? I ate my worksheets. What? Why would you do such a thing? Because my dog refused to. <coughs> well, Mrs. Talbot, I'm wondering if Ben's awake. Not yet, he's still sleeping. Oh, I was wondering if you wanted to come to my house today. Good morning, mommy. Who are you talking to? Your friend Luke's wondering if you want to go to his house. Can I? If you want to, say yes. He just woke up and he said yes. Dad, what does this say? Um, empty? Now what does it say? Empty. 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 So who do you like? No one. Come on, tell me who you like. I can't say. Who do you like? How many times are you going to ask me that same question? As many times as it takes you to say my name. <gasps> <laughs> Bro, why did you throw an apple at that kid? He said onions are the only food that makes you cry, so I was proving him wrong. <laughs> Bro, this class is so easy. I'm gonna do all my homework and get a good grade this year. Dude, I was thinking the exact same thing. Alright class, for homework I want you to do pages 35 to 52 in the textbook. <laughs> Forget that. Where are you going, sir? I don't know. I didn't decide yet. Are you joking? Tell me where you're going. I don't know, man. I didn't decide yet. Where should I go? Do you know who I am? Cool, so I don't know where I'm going and you don't know who you are. Mom, you lied to me. When, son? You said my younger brother is a small angel. So? Why didn't he fly when I threw him off the balcony? How can we keep our school clean? Timothy, by staying at home. Photos you're not allowed to see. You're not allowed to go into Area 51, but a pilot named Gabriel Ziefman broke those rules and flew over top. He took this photo in 2020 and it's the best one we have. Cameras have always been banned in the Supreme Court, but in 1932, Eric Sullivan snuck in a camera. He pretended to have a broken arm and hid his camera inside the cast. Five years later, there was another photo taken. A lady cut a hole in her purse and put a small camera in it. Since 1878, the most powerful people in the world meet at this forest in California, where they do lots of ceremonies and rituals. This includes presidents, billionaires, and business people. But a photographer named Gabriel Mulan snuck in and took a picture of them doing a ritual. Hello? <laughs> Yo, why you look like that? What do you mean? Uh, nah, what the? This is natural. This is natural? I'm, well, I'm TikTok famous, so I don't know if you want to be in a video or not. Do you want to be in a video? Do I want to be in a video? Yeah. Sure. Alright, here's my TikTok, hold on. Luca Davidson? Yes. Imagine why it's like a million followers. What the f you? He got 3.7 million! What do you want to do tonight? Hmm, why don't we go to the zoo? But babe, I'm not ready to meet your family yet. I have a terrible pain in my leg. I'm afraid it's just old age. That can't be right. You don't know what you're talking about. How could you possibly know that I'm wrong? Well, it's quite obvious. My other leg is the exact same age. <gasps> Hello. Hi. Can I try drawing you in 10 seconds? Sure. Alright, I just need you to count down from 10. And this isn't a joke, I'm actually going to try. Alright, ready? Yeah. 10, 9, 8, 7, 6, 5, 4, 3, 2, 1. Alright, are you ready? Yes. Aw, thanks. You're welcome. Have a good day. You too. Thank you. Today we're going to be learning about square root. Oh, everybody line up at the door. Hey, no running. We need to go in a single file line. Leave your backpack, Luke. We don't have time. But it's already on my back. I said we don't have time! Now everybody, follow me. Uh, miss, do you think we can...
I know I'm going to die, and I want to take my money with me. So I'm going to give each of you 150000 and I want each of you to make sure the money gets into my coffin. I can't live with this guilt anymore. I only put 100000 into his coffin. I'm glad you brought that up. I've been feeling guilty too. I only put in 80000 You guys should be ashamed of yourselves for stealing money like that. Am I the only honest person here? Look. I wrote a check for the full 150,000. <gasps> Do you think you could come in on Sunday? I know you like your weekends off, but I really need you here. Yeah, of course. I'll probably be late though because public transport is a bit slow on the weekends. Ah, thank you so much. When do you think you'll be here? Monday? <gasps> Hello? Hey man, are you busy right now? Uh, kind of. Why? Well, I have something really important to tell you. What are you doing? I'm watching a live stream. Do you mind calling me back when it's over? Yeah, of course. Okay, I'll talk to you later. Bye. Bye. I'm gonna break my dad with this empty toilet paper roll. I'm just gonna get it a little wet. Now I'm just gonna crumple it up. Now I'm just gonna set it right beside the toilet. So when he walks into the bathroom, this is what he sees. Now I just gotta wait until he gets home. He's just backing into the garage, now I just gotta wait until he goes to the bathroom. Just wondering why the door is closed. That's good. <laughs> oh my god. Is there a problem, officer? Ma'am, you are speeding. Oh, I see. Can I see your license, please? I'd give it to you, but I don't have one. You don't have one? I lost it four years ago for drunk driving. I see. Can I have your vehicle registration papers, please? I can't do that. Why not? I stole this car. Stole it? Yes, and I killed the owner. You what? His body's in the trunk. I need backup. Ma'am, could you step out of your vehicle, please? Is there a problem, sir? One of my officers told me that you stole this car and murdered the owner. Murdered the owner? Yes, could you please open the trunk? Is this your car? Yes, here are the registration papers. My officer claims you don't have a license. Here it is. My officer said you don't have a license, stole the car, and murdered the owner. I bet that liar told you I was speeding, too. Who is Alexander the Great? I don't know, ma'am. You need to focus more on your studies. Who are Brayden, Eric, and Jesse? How would I know? You need to focus more on your daughter. <gasps> hey, Luke. Huh? What are you doing? I'm doing my favorite supervillain's dance. Uh-huh. <laughs> I just love his laugh. <laughs> now what are you doing? I'm watching my favorite movie, The Joker. Now what are you doing? I'm playing this super fun zombie apocalypse game called State of Survival. Oh, I thought you were going to say something about the Joker. That's why I'm playing it. Huh? They're having a crossover with the Joker and I get to play as him. Oh no! The zombies are attacking my face! Don't ask me any more questions. Find out for yourself by pressing the button on Luke's TikTok profile. No, I should get it because I always get 100% on my tests. But I've never skipped a day of class. What are you two arguing about? We found this $20 bill and decided to give it to whoever could tell the biggest lie. You should be ashamed of yourselves. When I was your age, I didn't even know what a lie was. Ah, you win. <gasps> clean your room or I'm taking your phone. My room is clean. Then why is there clothes on the ground? I believe it's called gravity. Oh my god. You're a TikToker. What? How's it I'm going? I'm following you, dude. Yo, I'm following you. <laughs> How's it going? Oh, do the face, do the face. <laughs> what the heck? Can I tell you a joke? Yes. Yeah. Knock, knock. Who's there? A little old lady. A little old lady who? I didn't know you could yodel. Oh. Oh. A little old lady. Oh. Are you going to post this on TikTok? I don't know, can I? Please. Okay, maybe. I may. I might, I might. Yeah, I'll be on, I'll watch your account. All right, you'll be on okay, the lookout. Okay, bye. <coughs> <coughs> I got my dress. What? I don't sound like that. It must be my phone. Hey mom, since it's Friday, can you get pizza before you come home? Yeah, I guess. Oh, and can I go to my friend's house later? That's fine with me. Just ask your father. Can you ask him? Fine. Hey dad, can I ask you a question? What? Where's mom? Words can't even describe how beautiful you are. Aw, thank you. But numbers can. Come on, bro. Show me what you got. 
You're gonna catch one of these in the face if you're not careful. Oh yeah? Not if I beat you to it. Boys, can you please stop fighting? Yeah, she's right. Good fight. Yeah, bro. You throw a mean punch. Aw, thanks man. You have good form. I'll see you around. Thanks bro. Take care. Everyone who plays video games are nerds. I guess I'm a nerd then. I already knew that. Tell me something I don't know, freak. The taste of salad. <gasps> Sorry, I can't come into work today. Why not? Are you sick? It's my eyes. Why? What's wrong with your eyes? I just can't see myself coming to work today. <gasps> Thank you guys so much for 2 million followers. And you know, since I'm like a little bit more famous now, I wanted to see if I could get myself on the celebrity lookalike app. I gotta make sure I get my best angle. What? Roger Federer. Oh, must be the smile. If you want to find out what celebrities you look like, just click this link on my profile, then click celebrity lookalike to download the app, and let me know in the comments who you get. I'm so fat, I want to lose weight. How much do you want to lose? At least 10 pounds. Then I would try taking off your makeup. <gasps> All jokes aside, if you want to lose weight, click the link on my profile, then press workout from home to download it. Then once it installs, fill out the information and they'll give you workout videos to follow for your body type and goal. That's exactly what I need, thank you! <laughs> Why are you crying? I came here for a blood test. So? Are you afraid? No, for the blood test they cut my finger. Now why are you crying? I came for a urine test. Because flight attendants never tell passengers. Even if you ask for regular coffee, they'll give you decaf. Because they prefer you to sleep during the flights because it means less work for them. The water used for tea and coffee isn't the cleanest. It's the same as the water used for toilets as it's pumped from tanks that have probably never been cleaned. Locking yourself in the bathroom often isn't the best idea. Because it's possible to open them from the outside. And if you're found to be suspicious of anything unusual, you'll be taken to the police when you land. Sea trays are one of the dirtiest things on an airplane. Because although they clean the plane after all the passengers leave, they don't clean the trays because it would take too long. Oxygen Masks don't provide as much air as you would think. They only provide 15 to 20 minutes, which is just enough time for the plane to land. Everyone, please be quiet. Why do I still hear talking? Because you have ears. You look familiar. Shut up, you're not funny. What did the ocean say to the other ocean? I don't know. Nothing, they just wave. You're really not funny, by the way. Did you see what I did there? Shut up, you're not funny. Come on, I'm sure you did. Oh my god, no one likes you. Oh come on, don't be a beach. <gasps> Will you remember me tomorrow? Yeah. Will you remember me next week? Yeah. Will you remember me next month? Yeah. Will you remember me next year? Yeah. Knock knock. Who's there? See, you forgot me already. Biggest coincidences in the world. Shortly before their wedding, Nick and Amy decided to go through Nick's baby photos. In this picture of him playing at the beach during a vacation, Amy noticed herself in the background 11 years before they met. A reporter was asking people on the street in the UK if they remembered the final round of the 1967 FA Cup soccer game. The person he chose to interview turned out to be the goalie who played in the game, and look how happy he was. Do you remember it? Yeah, I do, I played in it. Did you? I was goalkeeper for Liverpool. Really? Yeah. Well, that's a stroke of luck me meeting <laughs> you. Yeah, yeah. Sorry, can you remind me of your name? Tommy Lawrence. The guys in these pictures look the exact same, but they're not even related. The first picture is Enzo Ferrari, who was a race car driver and the founder of the car brand Ferrari. The other guy is a soccer player named Mesu. But the scariest part is that Enzo died in 1988, which is the same year that Mesu was born. Hey, would you be happy if I got you jewelry for Valentine's Day? Aww, nothing would make me more happier. Sweetie? Happy Valentine's Day. Where's the jewelry? When I asked you if you wanted that, you said nothing would make you happier. <coughs> the test results are out. Come with me and we'll go see them. I'm with my dad. Can you look for me? And if I fail one subject, text me good morning to you. And if I fail two subjects, text me good morning to you and your dad. <coughs> Answers to three questions about planes you've always wanted to ask. 
Why don't they have the same seatbelts as cars? For shoulder straps to work, it has to be attached to something sturdy like a car frame. And airplane walls aren't equipped for that. If they were, it would make the plane heavier, making it burn more fuel. Plane seatbelts have lift lever buckles, making it stronger, and so you can't accidentally open it. Why do planes have red and green lights on their wings? The red light is always on the left wing, and the green light is always on the right wing. This way, other pilots in traffic control can tell which way the plane is flying. The two different colors also make it less likely for the plane to be confused with something like a drone. Why are the windows round? round Rounded corners help distribute stress, reducing the chance of it breaking. Square windows are dangerous because the sharp angles are easy to crack because of air pressure. Where do you live? With my parents. Where do they live? With me. Where do you all live? Together. Don't do it, I bet you'll regret it the rest of your life. You dummy, don't say yes! No! No! Dang, he finally did it! What an idiot! What are you watching? Our wedding. First name, Robin. Last name, the bank. So you're Robin the bank? I thought that you wanted yesterday afternoon off so you could see your dentist. That's right, sir. So why did I see you coming out of the movie theater with your friend? That was my dentist. Here's the only way to survive a falling elevator. Most people think you should jump right before you hit the ground. However, it'll be difficult to jump when you're falling. And secondly, if you're falling at a speed of 50 miles per hour and you jump 5 miles per hour into the air, you'll still hit the ground going 45 miles per hour. Now before I tell you what you should do, I found this app that lets you FaceTime with your favorite celebrities. Press this button on my profile if you want to try it too. Now instead of jumping, you should lie flat on your back, because this way the impact is spread equally through your whole body. But just remember, with today's modern safety features, your chances of dying are 1 in 10 million. I haven't drove a vehicle since I became the Pope, and since we have lots of time before the flight, can I drive the rest of the way? Of course! Hold on for a minute. Chief, we have a situation. I pulled over someone important. How important? A governor? No, sir. He's bigger. So what? A celebrity? More important, sir. A major politician? No, sir. He's much more important. Well, who is it? Well, actually, I'm not sure, but the Pope's his driver. <gasps> I can't wait for school pictures. The only thing you'll see is your ugly pimple. Too bad you can't photoshop your ugly personality. Can I borrow your phone to call my girlfriend? Yeah, of course. Your phone's a genius. When I put in her number, it said calling girlfriend. So I heard you like bad boys, huh? Well, sometimes I go for them. Why? Well, one time the teacher said, raise your hand if you know the answer. I knew the answer, but I didn't raise my hand. <gasps> what is your qualification? I'm a PhD. And what exactly do you mean by PhD? Past high school with difficulty. It says on the menu that you sell fat-free fries, is that true? Yep, 100%. Really? Well, then I'll get a large. Okay, it'll only be a minute. Wait a minute, why are the potatoes dripping with oil? I thought you said it was fat-free. It is, you only have to pay for the potatoes. <laughs> Where did you get that truck? I just bought it today. With what money? It only cost me $15. Who would sell a truck for that cheap? It was the lady down the street. She saw me riding my bike and asked if I wanted to buy her truck for $15. Oh my goodness, she must not be thinking right. You better go with him and see what's going on. Hi, I was wondering why you sold your truck to my son for $15. Well, two days ago I got a phone call from my husband's boss saying that he ran off to Hawaii with his secretary and doesn't intend on coming back. Oh my goodness, I'm so sorry, but what does that have to do with my son in your truck? Well, today my husband phoned to say his wallet was stolen. He said to sell his truck and send him all the money. So I did. Do you want to hear a blonde joke? Before you tell that joke, there's something you should know. And what's that? The bartender's blonde, the security guard's blonde, I'm six feet tall, 200 pounds of black belt in karate and blonde, the person on your right's a pro wrestler and blonde, and the person on your left's a weightlifter and blonde. Do you still want to tell that joke? Nah, not if I'm gonna have to explain it five times. <gasps> See that old lady right there? Do you wanna go steal her purse? No! Why would you even say something like that? Oh, my mom's calling. Hello? Hi, honey. You had to be worried. I've called you like five times now. Where are you? Tell her you're with me. Uh, I'm with Jesse. Oh, you're with Jesse? Why didn't you tell me? Can I talk to him? Sure. Hello, Mrs. Davidson. How are you? I'm good. How are you? Good, thank you. I'll drop off Luke in a few minutes. I know it's getting late. Oh, don't worry about it. I don't mind him being out late if it's with you. You're a good kid. Aw, thanks, Mrs. Davidson. Well, it was nice talking to you. You too. Bye. Jeez, what a good kid.
All right, I'll be right back. I'm gonna go rob that store that the lady just walked into. Are your parents bakers? No. Because you're a cutie pie. I'm just gonna skip you now. All right, see ya. If I could change the alphabet, I'd put you and I together. <laughs> Guess what my hoodie's made out of? Fabric. Boyfriend material. <laughs> <laughs> All right, see you guys. Are you leaving? No! I'm just saying goodbye, then walking outside to walk back in. Hey! Let go of my purse! No! Oh my gosh, did they just steal your purse? No! We're playing cops and robbers! <laughs> Why are you crying? I failed my math test. You what? Are you disappointed in me? No! I'm proud of you. Come give me a hug. Sis Emily, I have a boyfriend. I found your purse at Starbucks and it had your number on it, so I thought I'd let you know. Oh my goodness, where can I meet you to pick it up? I have a girlfriend. <laughs> I'm such a good sleeper. How do you know? I could do it with my eyes closed. Oh yeah? Well, I sleep better because I use this meditation app that increases focus, reduces stress, and makes you fall asleep faster. How do I get that? Click the link on my profile, then press meditation app and download it. I love you. I love you too. Prove it. Tell the world that you love me. I love you. What? I said tell the world. You are my world. <gasps> You What's your problem? I'm too smart for the first grade. My sister's in grade three, and I'm smarter than her, too. Well, then let's go see what the principal has to say. Okay. How about I give him a test, and if he fails just one question, he has to go back to class and be quiet. Okay, what's three times three? Nine. Six times six? Thirty-six. I see no reason why he can't go to the third grade. He answered all my questions right. Can I ask him some questions? Of course, go ahead. What does a cow have four of that I only have two of? Legs. What do you have in your pants that I don't have? Pockets. What does a dog do that a man steps into? Pants. What starts with F and ends with K? Fire truck. Put him in the sixth grade. I got the last four questions wrong myself. Uh. <gasps> I'm afraid I can't let your elephant in here, sir. Oh, I assure you, he's very well behaved. All right then, if you say so. I'm very surprised. Your elephant was well behaved and he even seemed to enjoy the movie. Yeah, I was surprised too. He hated the book. I want to break up with you. What? You'll never meet anyone else like me. Yeah, that's the whole point. I know. We're gonna rob the bank fast, okay? Okay, but why do I have a camera? Just in case the police show up, we'll tell them it's a prank. Mom, look what I got on my report card. Oh. You got one A minus and the rest A pluses. I thought I raised you better! You should have studied harder! Look what I got on my report card. Who are you? Your son? Oh yeah. What'd you get? I got all A pluses. Oh. Cool. Mommy, look what I got on my report card. Good job, honey. I'm so proud of you. You passed one class. Let's go for dinner to celebrate. What is your first wish? I wish I were rich. It's done. What is your second wish, Rich? Luke, what does IDK and IDC mean? I don't know, and I don't care. Excuse me? Also, Mom, what's for dinner? I don't know, and I don't care. You have one new voice message. Hi, honey, I just wanted to let you know that I'm going to be home late, so can you please wash my clothes and make my favorite meal for supper? Thanks. <laughs> yeah, right. Now what? Oh, and I forgot to tell you, I got a raise at my job, so I'm going to buy you a brand new car. What? Hello? Are you actually buying me a new car? No, I just wanted to make sure you got my first message. <laughs> my password's Luke123. What's yours? Mine is Superman, Batman, Flash, Iron Man, Deadpool, Loki, Thor, Spider-Man. Why is it so long? It had to be at least eight characters long. Do you want to be my partner? No, you're a loser. I may not be perfect, but at least I'm not you. Luke, you know why your name starts with an L? Why? Because you're a loser. L for loser. Hey, don't call me that. It makes me feel sad inside, and it really hurts my feelings. 
Oh yeah? And what are you going to do about it? Hey teacher, he called me a loser. Jesse, can you please say sorry to Luke? Fine. I'm sorry for calling you a loser. I shouldn't have said that. It's okay. Don't worry about it. Thank you. Do you want to be friends? Yeah, sure. We can be best friends forever. I wanted to say I like you. Do you like me? No. Oh. You never asked if I love you. Aww. Do you love me? No. <laughs> Class, today we're going to talk about tenses. For example, if I say I am beautiful, what tense is it in? Well, it's obviously the past tense. <gasps> Hello? Honey, it's me. Are you at the golf course? Yeah. Why? I'm at the mall. I found a leather coat. It's only $1,000. Can I get it? Sure. Go ahead if you really like it. I also stopped by the Mercedes dealership and seen one that I really liked. How much is it? 98000 Okay, but for that price, make sure it comes with all the options. Great! Oh, and one more thing. The house that I wanted last year is back on market for 980000 Well, then offer 900000 and they'll probably take it. But if not, offer an extra 50000 if you think it's a good price. Okay, I'll see you later. I love you so much. You're worth it. Bye. Does anybody know whose phone this is? Where is he? Hello? Where are you? I have lots of stuff to do today. Oh, um, remember that jewelry store that we went to a few months ago? Um, I think so. And remember when you fell in love with that diamond ring? Yeah, of course. How could I forget? And I couldn't afford it at the time, but I promised you I would get it when I propose. Yes, I do remember. Well, I'm in the store next to it. <laughs> Hello. Hello. Oh my gosh, I've seen you on TikTok. No. What? <laughs> wait, wait. No. Wait. 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 I'm waiting. Hold on. Wait. What kind of boys do you like? I like boys with a clean shave. You know that I won't stop until I make you mine. Hey, do you like me? I have a boyfriend. Can I take a picture of you? Four. So I can show Santa what I want for Christmas. Oh my god, why do you look like Penny Guys? Are you a photographer? No. Because I can picture us together. That was smooth. Can you help me? I'm lost. In my eyes. Okay. <laughs> yeah, I can No, help. I'm looking for directions to your heart, actually. Oh, Aww, that was cute. <laughs> have your son. I don't even have a son. Oh, yeah? Then who just asked me for warm milk and made me cut the crust off his sandwich? Oh, no! You have my husband! <laughs> I have a feeling that you are cheating on the test. What? Prove it. Well, one question was who was the first president? The girl beside you put George Washington and so did you. So? Everyone knows he was the first president. Well, just wait a minute. The next question was who freed the slaves? The girl beside you put Abraham Lincoln and so did you. Well, I read the history textbook last night and I remembered that. The next question was who was the president during the Louisiana Purchase? She put I don't know and you put me neither. <gasps> um, what's the chemical formula for water? H-I-J-K-L-M-N-O. What are you talking about? Yesterday you said it's H2O. You're such a loser. Who's interrupting me during my TikTok? What's this? A package from Captain Bling Bling? Let's see what we got. The new MacBook Pro? There's probably nothing even in. Are you serious? Let's see if it works. <gasps> Thank you so much, Captain Bling Bling. I thought you were fake. Son, you better pass that exam or else forget me as a father. Sure, Dad. So, how was your exam? Who the heck are you? Shoes you're not supposed to see. Here's what an owl looks like without any feathers. This is what tiger skin looks like. Here's a human heart without any blood. This is what the bottom of a fire hydrant looks like. Here's the inside of a turtle's mouth. Here's the inside of a bowling ball. And here's the inside of a dice. My boyfriend got me a new tab. Wow, I'll ask my boyfriend if I can get one. You know Babe, can you get me a new tab, please? Sure, open your laptop. Online booking? You know I love you so much. Now open Google Chrome. Done. Mine. Now press Control T. <gasps> so why did you bring your cat in today? I think there might be something wrong with her eyes. She keeps knocking into things. Interesting. Can I see her? Yeah, here you go. 
All right, I'm just going to quickly examine her. I'm going to have to put her down. What? Why? Because my arms are getting sore. If you can make me laugh, I'll PayPal you money. Go. Like, Yo, what oh. the heck? You better be joking. Stop. There's a ghost in your house. Don't just stand there. Run. There's a ghost. Run. Yeah, run. I'm not just going to like get out of my house. Where am I going to go? I don't know. Anywhere but... Go, man. I cannot do this right now. I can like... Dude, there's someone in the back. What the f- Dumbest Things Bought by Billionaires Part 2 When a Hong Kong businessman inherited a 26 karat black diamond, he decided he wanted to keep it with him at all times. He got a craftsman to make him a custom iPhone 5 with the diamond mounted on the home button. The back of the phone is covered in 24 karat gold, the sides are layered with 653 white diamonds, and the screen is sapphire glass made with real sapphires bringing the total cost of the phone to 15 million dollars. Does anyone know of a bird that has wings but can't fly? Yeah, I know. Okay, tell us. A dead one. Do you know how to solve this? No, I don't. Okay, I'll erase it. Until I make you mine. You know that I Who is the president of Iraq? I don't know, miss. You need to focus more on your studies. Please, miss, can I ask a question? Go ahead. Do you know Angela? No. Why? Then you need to focus more on your husband. <gasps> Sir, your x-ray showed a broken rib. What? Will I survive? Don't worry, we fixed it with Photoshop. Here's the three most dangerous kid toys. The kite tube was made to be pulled behind a boat and then raised up into the air. But when people would get up into the air, they would have no control. And although it looks fun, three adults were killed from falling off. This floaty was made for babies to sit in. However, it was cheaply made and ripped easily, causing babies to fall into the water. The company was fined $650 for knowing about this problem for six years. Slip and slides may not seem dangerous, however, they're only meant for kids. In 1993, there was a warning issued for teens and adults using slip and slides. The slides aren't long enough for their size and weight, so people People were getting hurt from the sudden stop. At the time of the warning, one teenager and seven adults had become paralyzed from neck injuries. Where are you going? No. See, that always happens. I didn't like the first one, so I'm going to do a whole bunch of more takes until I get it. But I'm just going to show you guys the good takes so the video doesn't take forever. Because even though it's only like a 15, 30 second video, it takes a lot more time than, than you would think. Where are you going? No. Nope. Where are you going, sir? No. Nope. I have to get it perfect. This, this is why it takes forever. <laughs> Where are you going, sir? That one was better. Go with that one. And then, like I said, I'm going to film all of this character first so I don't have to keep taking off my hoodie. Can I go to the washroom? It's not can I go to the washroom, it's May. You're wrong. It's February. No, I know. Kids who remember their past lives. Sam Taylor is a boy who was born shortly after his grandfather passed away. And in his first year, he already had memories of his grandfather's life. He even said to his father, I remember when I used to change your diapers. When Sam's father was changing his. Shanae is a boy who was born with two birthmarks on his head. From the age of three, he started having memories of his past life as a teacher, who was killed by a gunshot to the head. James Leininger is a kid who started having nightmares at the age of two, about his past life as a World War II pilot. He claimed that in his past life, he was the pilot James Houston, who was shot down in action in the Pacific Ocean. Lucky discoveries that made people rich. A collector bought a painting and when he went to fix the frame, he realized that inside was a piece of paper. But it wasn't just any piece of paper. He found a copy of the United States Declaration of Independence. He bought the painting for $4, but the piece of paper is worth almost $1 million. A man whose hobby is to use a metal detector to search for treasure got really lucky. He found a strange greenish piece with a red engraving, then a chain, and finally a Celtic treasure, which is again worth close to $1 million. As a couple was packing to move to a new house, they found an action comic comic book number one, dated 1938 in one of the boxes in their attic. Only 99 copies of this comic exist and each are sold for 1.5 million dollars. What kind of boyfriend are you looking you for? A boy who doesn't drink or smoke and he must wake mind. up at 5 a.m. and go to you sleep at 9 p.m. I know where you could find a boy like that. Mind. You do? Where? In jail. <gasps> How I act when my parents are sleeping. How my parents act when I'm sleeping. Oh. 
bought this lie detector, so if you lie, it'll beep. Okay? So, you were at school today, right? Yeah. Okay, okay, I was at the movies. Alright, I went for a beer with my friends. What? When I was your age, I never would have touched alcohol. <laughs> he really is your son. <laughs> what was that for? I was doing your laundry when I found a piece of paper in your pocket with the name Mary Lou on it. Who is she? Are you cheating on me? Honey, don't worry about it. Remember three weeks ago when I went to the horse race with my friends? Mary Lou was the horse I was betting on. Oh, good. I'm going to continue with the laundry. Ah! What was that for? Your horse call. <gasps> uh, excuse me, where's my table? Hi, miss. Uh, what's the name on the reservation? I don't need a reservation. I know the owner. I'm sorry, but we can't seat you unless you have a reservation. Are you serious? You're the worst waiter I've ever met. Just let me in. I'm sorry, but I can't. You either have to wait two hours or make a reservation for another night. You know what? You're going to regret this. I'm going to show you that I know the owner. Hello? Hi, sweetie. I need you to call the owner right now, please. Okay. Hello? I'm not going to school anymore. What? Why not? On Monday morning, the teacher said four and four make eight. What's wrong with that? On Tuesday, she said six and two make eight. Yeah, she's right. Now today, she said five and three make eight. So I'm not going back until she makes up her mind. Duh. Doctor, I'm having a tough time losing weight. What should I do? From now on, I want you to split everything you eat. So for example, if you want a banana, just have half of it. Okay, I'll give it a try. Thanks.